Hello, welcome to a new weekly vlog. You're in the cupboard again. It worked so well last time that I thought I'd just put you in there. But I'm so excited for my lunch today because... Ha! Hat! 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 Leftover Chinese! Thank you very much! Yes, yes, yes! So hungry right now! Mmm! I don't know why, but I think Indian, like curries and stuff and Chinese taste so much better the next day like reheated especially Indian because I think all the flavours like get into the chicken and stuff so much better mm, who's hungry now <laughs> I think someone's just pulled up outside the house I don't know though it's raining so I can't make out like normal sounds or rain sounds <laughs> hold on let's have a peek I think I imagined it. I feel like when like an old lady, you know, when they hear something outside, they're like, hello? That's what I feel like right now. I've started vlogging, so I wanted to show you my new little cactus that mum got me. Look at this. It's so cute. I don't think I showed you this in um, last week's vlog. I don't know. This would make a really good picture. I'm just gonna quickly take this as a picture. Hold up. Okay, done. Isn't it so cute? It's literally tiny. So what a cute little foxy. I love him. He still doesn't have a name though, guys. Come on, we need to name him. He's really cute. But yeah, mum picked this up for me. It's so nice and I love that it goes with like all my orange theme as well. I see like my orange rug and pillows and stuff. And she also got me this little one here, which I don't know how you can see it because it's quite dark. I have no idea what it is, but it's really pretty. And I kind of want, this is mum's pot, so I want to like get a nicer pot than that. Yay for flowers. I was also thinking of maybe like re-signing up with Bloom and Wild. If you haven't heard what Bloom and Wild is, okay, my phone's going kind of crazy right now. Then, um, although I'm pretty sure most of you probably do, it's like a subscription for flowers and you can like have flowers delivered every month or every week or every two weeks that sort of thing so you've always got fresh flowers i'm thinking of maybe doing that once i've moved so that i've always got some pretty flowers or something in my room just because flowers make me happy and we need everything that makes us happy at the moment don't we let's see who my messages are from zoe and katie hello um so yeah that's what i'm thinking because they do do some really, really, really nice flowers. And I just love having flowers in my room. Hence why I've like got all of these plants and stuff. Because I do want to have quite a lot of flowers in my room. And like plants and greenery. Just because they make me happy. I think they make the room look like seem cosy and nicer and stuff. So that's my plan. I have lots of plans. So whether these all plans come together, I don't know. Um, but yeah, I've only got one light on in this room and it's really bright. All I've got on is that one. Look how bright that is. So bright. Look how cute my dressing table is. I love it. It's so cute. My plan for tomorrow is to sort through my bed because I've got so much junk in there that I need chucking out anyway. I need, I need to throw loads of stuff out anyway. And then my plan is when I've got room in my bed, the stuff that I've got left at the top of my wardrobe, so up here can go in my bed and then mum can use this my wardrobe as extra storage or something i'm not taking everything with me because there isn't room for it but i'm taking most things and then what i can't take okay then what i can't take i want to put in my bed to yeah like i said like have so this can be clear for like extra storage and stuff so that's tomorrow's plan and within the next two seconds it will be tomorrow so i'll see you in the morning <laughs> You're going to have to excuse how I look right now. But I'm just like tidying my room. And I've seen something really weird on my rug. And I don't know what it is. I think it's like a weird beetle thing. I don't know. I don't know what it is. And I don't know how I'm going to get it. Because it's like in my rug. What is that? Oh, I feel a bit sick looking at it. Ew. I genuinely can't get it off. It's like stuck. Stuck to the rug. This is terrifying for me. Get off! Let go! Oh my god! Literally! What are you? Are you even alive? <coughs> I'm so confused by you. Let go! Oh! My rug! Oh! <sighs> I actually feel a bit 
I feel a bit queasy. I've got like hot flushes. Oh, I don't know if it's alive or dead. Like I don't even know what it is. This is horrible. I'm so scared to lift up the bug catcher in case it like legs it. But it's in such a place that I don't think I can shut it. I don't even know if you're alive. I can't, I can't pick it up. <laughs> I'm just gonna have to leave it there for a bit. What even is that? What is it and where did it come from? I really don't like this. I hate bugs. It's gone. I can now continue my day. <laughs> Guys, the neat freak in me is kind of losing her mind a little bit. Um, not coping well. On a good side, I found my like last ever pair of point shoes and I didn't have them long enough or I didn't dance long enough with them to even put ribbon on. So they have no ribbon on them. Look at my little point shoes. Oh my god, I miss points so much. I used to absolutely love dancing on these beauties so much. Oh, I love them. My balance is definitely not what it used to be though. <laughs> Aren't point shoes and dancing on point some of the prettiest things ever? I love it. Oh. Happy memories. I'm apparently the hoarder of photos. Look how cute I was. <laughs> In this I look like I have a really big head though. I don't, look, another one of those comb headbands. And I found some of my ballet photos after finding my point shoes, if it will focus on it. This was after one of my grades, I think. Yeah, I think this was taken after one of my grades because you always had to wear a proper tutu for your exams. And then here's another one. Look, Danielle, it's you. <laughs> we were so cute. There's another one too. Oh my goodness. Look at those uniforms. Look at my frilly socks. Best days of my life. I absolutely loved ballet. Welcome to Thursday. I fell out vlogging. <laughs> I went out for dinner yesterday with, after work with my dad and my brother, um, which was really nice actually. We went to the No Hurry, um, which was, it's quite near me to be fair. Um, it's really, really nice there. They've just had like a new massive conservatory section built um, and it's right on the river and it's just really, really nice. Although yesterday was an awful day when we got there. Like it was pouring down with rain, it was horrendous. But it was nice to see my dad and then we went back to Chris's because he hasn't actually seen Chris's house yet. And if you follow Chris on Twitter, you will know that he is looking to move again. So we were like, you kind of need to see his house because he's not going to be there much longer. Um, so yeah, it was a really nice evening. Work was fine. And then I slept like absolute crap. I like slept so bad last night. So I think I probably got about three hours sleep in total. So I'm very tired today. Very much looking forward to my bed tonight. Can I get in it now? Can I just go home? Can I just not go to work? Because that's how I feel right now. And I promise you I will show you what I got from Zara tonight when I get home. Because um, I didn't go back on my lunch yesterday. I don't know if, I did film a clip yesterday. I don't know if I'm going to put it in or not. I haven't actually watched it back. Um, but yeah, I went to Zara on my lunch on Tuesday. Yeah, Tuesday. Um, and I haven't actually shown you what I got and there was something to return and exchange and whatever. So I'll do that today because I couldn't be bothered to go out on my lunch yesterday. You know, when you sit down, you're just like, I cannot be bothered with people, especially in Zara because everyone in Zara is moody and I just couldn't be bothered with the mood, especially when you take something back or like you're changing something. They, for some reason, absolutely hate that and they just get really rude and I just couldn't be bothered with it. So I didn't. So I'm going to do it today instead. Hopefully if um, my part-timer doesn't call in sick because she went home early yesterday. I'm like, please don't call in sick tomorrow because I have stuff to do and I didn't do it today because I was lazy. But yeah, I'm really early today. I've got, because I didn't sleep very well. I was like awake really early. So I left early, which means I'm here early, which means I'm having a chit chat with you because I've sucked at vlogging this week. But tomorrow I am getting LVL lash like the lash treatment. I've had it done before. I had it done a few years ago, probably like three, 
maybe three years ago I had it done and I absolutely loved it although the treatment itself makes me feel pretty claustrophobic because they like tape your eyes down and I was like shall you have to talk to me the whole way through this so I'm gonna freak out um so I'm probably gonna be the same this time but I'm getting my hair cut my eyelashes done and my eyebrows done because they need doing too tomorrow which I'm very much looking forward to I am excited to get my lashes done it's been a while but then on saturday you can't really wear mascara for like 48 hours after so i can't wear mascara on saturday so i was like i'm gonna look really ill and tired um and then saturday evening i think we're going out for dinner for my well it's my leaving meal but they're calling it my birthday meal because obviously it's, they're about the same time um because my birthday is next sunday the 6th so yeah they're calling it my birthday meal but I don't know how many people can come, which sucks. It was last minute to be fair, we've not been very organized with it. There's been a lot going on, but yeah, that'll be fun. Does possibly mean the vlog's gonna go up late though. I didn't think of that. Hmm, I need to go because someone's just pulled up behind me, goodbye. So I'm just sat here editing and a clip from yesterday, so Friday hasn't worked, like the first clip. And it's really frustrated me. So the second clip seems really confusing. But basically, I said in it that I was going to go get my lashes done. I was going to go get LVL. And that I was excited. And that I showed you a, bef I sh I showed you a before. Which is really frustrating because now you're gonna, not going to see a before and after. I'm sure you all remember what my lashes looked like before I had it done. But yeah, that's really frustrating me. Oh well. On to... The rest of Friday. They're all done. I'll give you a close up in a second. But I've also had some layers popped into my hair. It's been such a long time since I've had any form of like style in my hair. Because if you remember, I had loads cut off a while ago. Um, and yeah, I've just kind of been trying to get it back to a really healthy state. So I haven't been having any hairstyles. And today I was like, do you know what? I think it's time for a few layers. So I've just got a few like choppy ones around the front, they don't go too high, they literally come to like my shoulder. Um, just for a bit of fun, it'll look cute if it's curly, that sort of thing, it's a bit flat, it always goes flat once I've had it cut. But I've had my eyebrows done, I've had my eyelashes done, so let's go close, cause, so you can, I'm really sorry about my skin. <laughs> I'm obviously still a bit red from my eyebrows as well, but seriously, <sighs> I love them. I really do really highly recommend LVL to people who, especially people who have like straight lashes and really struggle, like I'm quite lucky, um, I've got quite long, long lashes that don't really struggle to curl, but it's nice, it's going to be nice to not have to worry about curling them, it's going to be so much quicker to do my mascara, I'm not going to need as much mascara, so yeah, and it looks like I've got some on from here. Oh, I just love it. I love it so, so much. If you're in the Cambridge area, I highly recommend Shell. I'm going to leave her website and everything down below for you. So go and check her out. She always does my eyebrows. She cuts my hair. She always has for a really long time, actually, now. Um, and she's done LVL for me before. And I just I just can't get enough of that girl. I love her to pieces. She's amazing. And she's just such a nice girl as well. Um, to the point where, even when I move... I'm going to plan in my appointments around my rotors so that I can come back and see her because I don't want to go to anybody else. I don't, I just don't. I love her to pieces. She's one of my friends as well and yeah. So yeah, all her details will be down below. She's the beauty shell. She is based in Cambridge in the Science Park near Milton. Um, super easy to get to and I just love her. <laughs> She's based inside a gym as well, so you can always combine a treatment with a workout or something like that. I don't know. I always feel so unfit when I go in because I'm like, I just don't go to the gym, um, which I really probably should do. But I might do a workout this afternoon, actually. I was debating that. But I'm currently sat in the car park in town because I called mum after my treatment and was like, um, do you want to come into town with me? I need to go to Primark to pick up a few things. I want to I go get some hangers and stuff and have a look at their bedding, see if there's any, anything in there and have a look at their shoes because I need to get some summer shoes because I literally live in my, um, my Converse and I'm like, I need to get some summer shoes. So that's my plan. So I'm just chilling, waiting for mother. I can't even go on my phone because I have no data until the second. <laughs> so I'm like, I can't even play on this and tweet people and stuff but 
that's why I'm having a little chin wag with you but I'm meeting her at 20 past it's about five past now we're gonna go get some lunch and go into Primark I could just wander around on my own but I really can't bother to be honest that's quite partly why I rang her because I, like, I don't really want to be on my own because I'm going to spend, I think, on my week off, pretty most of that is going to be spent on my own because the girls are obviously at work and I won't be. So I'm probably going to be on my own for most of that. So I want to make the most of spending time with people because um, I feel like my week off is going to be quite lonely. What a transition. I'm going to go move to London and everything and then just be on my own. <laughs> oh, well. I do like my own company. In fact, I'm a big fan of my own company. But when you're in a new place and you're not in your like comfort zone sort of thing, it's a bit scarier being in your own. I really like my layers though. I tell you what, Rachel, if you're watching, I know how much you want me to get like a long bob. You're right, probably would suit me, but I'm not going to do it. <laughs> I'm still not going to do it. I want to grow my hair again, I think. I'm going to grow it again. It was so long. I was looking through pictures before and before I had like my massive cut and it was so long I loved it but it was in such bad condition which you can tell now now I was in really good condition you can tell how bad it was but yeah I'm really hungry my stomach's rumbling should I go enough of car chats I mean, yeah enough of car chats four minutes of car chats Cara I'm home now my hair looks weird because I've just had it up in a ponytail went to Primark and I picked up three packs of the rose gold hangers because my wardrobe's quite small so i don't know if i said this earlier so um it will be better to have like the same hangers because it just they everything sits better if it's on like the same shape and size and type of hanger so i've done that and i picked up some bottom sheets for like fitted sheets for the bed and then went into oasis and picked up a t-shirt but a bit, uh, picked it up in white but it's so see-through um, but mum's going back into town tomorrow so she's going to take it back and exchange it for me for the same thing but in I want two different colours so they do it in like a it's just a plain t-shirt for 14 14 pounds I think which is quite pricey but the style of it's really nice and it's quite flattering so she's going to pick it up in a car key for me and I think I'm going to ask her to get a um light grey and they did a dark grey as well so I'm tempted to get a dark grey but we'll see so yeah that's where we're at and I'm out tomorrow night, so I'm going to start editing the vlog, I think, now, so I don't have as much to do. And see where we get to. Although my iMovies is currently frozen, which is brilliant. It's really useful. So we have to reboot my laptop, I think. Let's do that right now. Shut down. No, restart. We'll restart. I'm trying to quit iMovie, it won't restart, but I'm just going to have to do it in, like, just, just shut down. I'll be back. Vlog is edited up to this very second in time, um, and I'm going to go to bed. I've had some cereal for, bre for breakfast. I had cereal for breakfast. I've had some cereal for dinner, and I'm just in a really bad mood. And then, I don't really know why, so I'm just going to put something on my laptop, and I'm going to go to bed, and I'm going to have an early night, and I'm going to go to bed at 9pm. Which isn't a bad thing, it's probably going to do me good to have like another good night's sleep because I slept so well last night compared to the night before. Slept so well. Um, so hopefully that will happen again. But yeah, I can't stop looking at my eyelashes. I love that. <laughs> Remember all of Shell's details are down below if you do want to get them done yourself or and you're in the Cambridge area or anything like that or any sort of beauty treatment at all check out Shell because she is amazing and let me know let her know that I sent you yeah I feel like I just look like I haven't quite got ready today having no mascara on <laughs> it feels weird being at work no mascara We were out. Also, I have mascara on. Look at those lashes. They're insane. Literally, no curling needed. My hair is annoying me. No curling needed at all. I 
obsessed message obsessed with them they're so long can you tell from the side i don't know i can't even see if you can see so long very happy i had a really nice evening the girls having a few drinks having some tapas we went for tapas you coming up um and the girls got me some really lovely presents for like birthday and leaving sort of thing and I left them at work so I will show you them tomorrow so next week's vlog you'll see those I'll show you the lovely things that they got me and I've got two cards to open but apparently I need to wait a little bit before I open my leaving one I think I'm probably gonna cry it's getting a bit real now I think also my hair has gone annoying and frizzy but that is life I just can't get over my eyelashes really to be honest with you um, but I'm going to end the vlog so that I can finish editing it, get it uploaded ready for you tomorrow. So I really hope you enjoyed this week's vlog. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Leave me a comment down below. You guys have stopped commenting as much and it makes me sad. So if you've watched the vlog and you've reached this point, leave me a comment down below. Let me know that you reached the end of the vlog um, because it makes me really happy to read all of your comments. Let me know if you've had LVL before and how you found it and how long it lasted for you and things because... I'm obsessed with this treatment so, so much. Like, I feel like I want to get it all the time. <laughs> I can't get over how long my lashes are. Literally. Also, how, just how bad my skin is. I feel like my hair has been cut really short. I like my layers, but I do feel like it's a bit short now. Anyway, where were we? We were saying goodbye. Yeah. I hope you've had a lovely week. I hope you have a really good week coming up. This is my last week at work with the girls. So it's going to be an emotional one this week. I know it is. Um, but yeah, I'll see you next week, guys. Bye.